What local California environmental issues do you find most pressing and which ones are you participating with most actively? Um, I've been mapping this. I've been mapping problems across the United States. We're getting ready to, to put a new map out live and it's heat censored and we're going to get communities to start building themselves within that map. But California is, is covered in red dots yes. of locations that we're dealing with. You know, there's a whole lot of issues going up on the Bay and we've got, you know, things in the San Joaquin Valley, you know, PG&E polluted out there just like they did in Hinkley. You've got similar problems in Bakersfield, you know, two issues down in Carson. You know, we were doing Beverly Hills High, and oil problems and nuclear meltdowns and uh, I sh I, there's a lot. It, it's sad. Yeah. You now I get drawn back in in the situation with Rocketdyne, which is just right over our shoulder here and communities reporting, you know, too many people with cancer. Uh, there's definitely a lot of issues in the state of California. Yeah, it's, it's interesting, you know, because people think of California, you think, you know, such a, a green, progressive state. And we were just discussing, you know, how just pretty much right down the road over here, you know, we had, the, I think, the third or fourth largest oil spill in the history of the world. Oh, ab absolutely. And I thought you were going to say rocket dying in the nuclear meltdown, which was the second. So that's right. why I held up a number two. So uh, another story.